guys, it's me Lover with another video. I'm very sad today because I forgot to, to review this book and I forgot to review this book. So I read this book like a couple days ago and I recorded it on my mom's phone but I forgot and I accidentally deleted the video. I forgot I didn't upload it. So I gotta up I'm gonna make this video of this right now and I'm gonna make this video as well. So we're reviewing volume eight and nine. I'm so sorry for the delay, but I'll finish it right now. I'll tell you guys. Let's go into volume eight. Oh, I'm gonna say this again. Okay. Are you mate? I won't die. Chapter 63, I won't die. So um Luffy is like I'm gonna Luffy's very mad at uh Krieg because he killed um him. Uh, killed Gin. He didn't die yet, but yeah. And Luffy goes to fight. And Luffy, nearly so powerful, he d he does what? Gum gum bullet. Gum 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 bullet. Look what he did, hey yo! Look what he did. Luffy is like so powerful. Like he's so powerful. Luffy was very powerful in this one. And Don Creek gets up again. And then chapter 64, the mighty battle spear. Mm. Luffy brings uh, him down again. Luffy brings him down again. He draw he brings Don Creek down twice. The mighty battle spear. And then he takes out the battle, mighty battle spear, the most dangerous he has, I think. And they fight more and more. And then finally Luffy gets onto the thing. And then Luffy fights more. Luffy falls down, but and then chapter 65 prepared. Luffy falls down. And then Luffy gets up. Then he does. Then he does. Gum gum Gatling gun. Doesn't do that. He doesn't do damage. This was so cool. He does gum gum Gatling gun. Doesn't do that much. He gets punched. And then uh, and then he says gum gum Gatling gun and. When he gets punched and bullet, and he literally bore, hits him so hard. Well, wait, did he? No, he didn't. Kinda, he hit him a little bit. And then he does gum gum, and then he gets into a trap. Luffy gets into a trap, but he actually escapes. He gets him trapped. There's like bombs up there. And then he wants to do gum gum, he goes up, he want, it's a trap. Sanji's like, it's a trap, it's a trap. And he does gum gum bazooka. And he hits him off the thing. But nothing happens. But he did a crack a little like thing in his armor. And I thought Luffy was gonna get die. No, not die, like hit. And then he does gum gum bazooka. Look at that. He's so powerful. Chapter 65, the chewed up spear. Everybody's like, Don Krieg, bro. And then Don Krieg is still alive. He puts him in a net. He puts Luffy in a net and traps him. And he still fights. He tries to get out. And Don Krieg is like, he's he tries to throw him into the water. And, but Luffy does a gum gum giant gavel and destroys Don Cree. He destroys him. And Luffy, I think Luffy fell in the, fall into the water. Yeah, Luffy fell in the water and Sanji goes to save him. Yeah. And Jin is like, I'm gonna take, uh, I only have like a few hours left, but I'm gonna take Don Cree and yeah. Chapter six, and the chapter 67, the, the soup. So Gin leaves, and then Luffy wakes up and he's like, "What hat?" 
and then they go and eat at the place they go eat and when they go eat uh they're having like a fight like Sandy's food is so bad and everything then it's chapter 68 oh. oh no mind and then uh, Chef Zeph punches Sanji and Sanji's like crying outside. Chapter 67 is 68, the fourth person. And then, and then he's like, and then Chef Zeph is like, do you want the, do you want Sanji and leave this place? And he's like, maybe. And then Yusaku comes and he says what happened. That Johnny, Lolo, and they, they, they are there. And... Sanji accepts of being the new crew member, let's go. And they leave all, all the leave. Emotional breakdown. And everything, they leave. And then chapter 69, Arlong Park. Maybe, no? Um, so they go on the boat. And then Yosoku's like the seven lords of the seven warlords of the sea, and Mihawk was one of the se one of the seven. And he's so powerful, right? So there's said like, so many powerful guys. Look at the hair, Luffy. Luffy drew a. Uh, a fish and now me <laughs> he's so mad because Sanji's in love with her look at this so. but guys I was so sad in volume 9 let me keep reading this and say this volume 9 was the saddest one and then I go to Captain Nazumi of base Navy base 16 or something and then we're, we're meeting Sawtooth Orlong right there that sawtooth Arlong. He's so evil, right? And then we see Hachi, Hach Hachman, Hachan, ha or Hachi, Arlong's first mate. And we see, we see Nami. And Nami like hits a kid, and that kid's like, "You evil witch!" And then um, Usopp, uh, Johnny, and Zolo are there. Lolo's better now. Yeah, and then chapter 70, uh, uh, the great adventure of the Usopp, of Usopp the man. The great adventure of the, of Usopp the man. And so they decide to leave and leave Zolo on the ship. And they just leave. And so funny. So the Arlong guys find Zolo in the ship. <laughs> and they're like, <laughs> It's so hilarious. They're like, let's kidnap you know, this guy in the airboat. Like, he doesn't know. And then they go to the park, I think Orlong Park, and they find. I don't know, is it Coco or. I forgot the village. It's like three villages. And look at this. It's destroyed. It's like, what happened here? Then the, it's like monsters there. And then we see Najiko. And Najiko. We don't know who Najiko is, and she's a big part in this. We go talk to Najiko, and Najiko said, and Najiko is like, and then, and then Yusuf's like, I'm here to find my my Nami. She's my Arlong. She's my friend, and is she in Arlong's crew? And like, and and then. Now Jiko's like, well, this is the house she where that witch grew up. Nami is my stepsister. What? Like, Nan Nami is a stepsister of Najiko. So I was like, we just found a stepsister. Wow. Chapter seventy one, Lords of All Creation. They're like, what? 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 And yeah, they're like all scared. Okay, three Ghost of Village. There's Ghost of Village, Cocoa Village, and Arlong Park. And also, guys, chapter and vo volume nine, you will understand why Nami is being evil. You can understand, you will understand. And then 
and Zolo is like trapped. And Zolo jumps into the water and kills himself. And then Nami like saves him. And Nami like hides him in a room. And then we see Genzo, the Coco villager. And then at the end, uh, before escape, hurry before Arlong gets back. Like Nami is like trying to help Zolo. That's how volume A is. Volume A, the viewing rating of nine point six. I like the subs history. I like that they finished Donkey. This was very good. But nine volume guy was so sad. I almost cried. It was so so sad. Like Nami had the toughest childhood of ever. Not bro, bro. Like even I got so sad for like Saji, but this is way way sadder. Like this book saw tears. Chapter nine is tears, and I almost had tears. It was so so sad. I'll tell you guys what happened. Start. So chapter seventy two, proper living. Ugh. I don't want to cry. It's so sad. Very sad. So Arlong's like, I'm gonna kill all you guys for doing, giving me money. And Arlong like beats up Genzo, the fire village, the villager. And then Usopp comes in like hiding and he throws like a throwing star. And the Arlong, the guys are like chasing him. And uh, chasing Usopp, Usopp runs. And then, nice. Like this, look at look at this. Zolo is such a boss. He's standing on Arlong's feet. He's such like a big guy. Like, I was like, what? And then, chapter 30, 73, Monsters on the Grandma. Oh my god, that's so good. This monster on the Grandma was such a good chapter. So, so this guy, Hachi, he's like, uh, what's his name? Uh, Mumu, Mumu, come out and eat your food and stuff. And like, Zolo doesn't know what that is. And then, and then uh, Zolo talks like, can you, I'm a, can you, I'm a guest, can you bring me to uh, Arlong and stuff, and yeah. And then Hachi's like, sure, why not? And then, then look at this. And then we go to Luffy and uh, Zol Luffy, Sanji, and uh, Yosaku. And they're like, and they see this sea monster. Ah! Sea monster called Mumu, the sea cow. So that's what, I think it escaped, I guess. It escaped from the Harlong pirates. And they try and fight it. Luffy does a gum gum pistol on it, hits it. And Sanji's like, no, I gotta go feed it. And it tries to kill Sanji, and Sanji kicks it. But then he does, Sanji does, uh, oof, what's called? Clear, Kalia Coop. And he literally like knocks down the thing. And then we go into Zolo. Zolo <laughs> is brought to um, Arlong Village and uh, Arlong Park. And at Arlong Park, Arlong is like crying, brother. <coughs> like that. <coughs> I don't think, it, yeah. And then this guy, like this ugly guy comes. He looks like Django, the Django from like, yeah. He brings him, he brings Django, uh, he brings the guy, and uh, he brings you off to the arm. Uh, and yeah. Uh, chapter 74, business. And then Nami's like, I'm gonna kill this guy. Nami's like, I'm gonna kill him. Nami wants to fight Usa and he destroys he and he kind of like he kind of destroys Usa and kills Usa kills Usa I'll tell you guys I'll tell you guys he kills Usa and throws him in the water that's very sad and Nami's like 
I'm sick of your suspicions. All I hear about is buying that village. So I was like, wait, what? And then I actually, my thought was she was actually gonna buy the village. That's what I thought. No, no, I didn't like not thought. Like, I was like, maybe if she gives them money like that. And then Luffy, Yusaku, and Sanji find Zolo. Chapter 675 of Max and Fishman. They find Zolo, I guess. And they talk. And then Johnny comes in, tells Sanji, Yosaku, Zolo, and Luffy that Usopp's dead. And, but it's not kind of that true. And then there's like a Navy ship come. Like a Navy ship. The Chico comes and there's like a Navy ship. They don't know what that's about. And then the people like fire the Arlong pilots fire missiles at it. And they kill them. They destroyed the Navy ship. And they can't get any help. And then and then Nami comes in, she and then Chabi is chapter seventy six and sleep. Nami comes in and tells, I don't care about you guys, go away from me and everything. And Zolo and Sanji fight a little bit over, like, Zolo doesn't like Nami, and Sanji has a crush on her. And then Luffy falls down and takes a nap, and it's so funny, he's so funny. Luffy is the, the, the weirdest guy. And then Usopp is starting to walk, and he's like, if she was a witch to go to the core, she wouldn't have saved me. So Nami, it's business. Uh, if Nami hadn't done what she did, Arlong would have killed me for sure. So Nami actually saved Usopp. She actually did. She actually didn't kill them. It was like fake blood and stuff. And yeah. And then... And then Nami's like sad in her house in Coco Village. She's like sad and uh, let with Nojiko. And everything and yeah. And Nami falls asleep. And then Usopp's like, oh guys, don't think bad of her. And then so Nojiko comes and like, you guys don't know what she's going through right now. And then, and then uh, this guy named I am uh, I am Captain Nozumi Nozumi Captain Nozumi of Navy Base Sixteen comes, and we don't know who he is. And it's Chapter Seven Seven, the first step toward a dream. And then so, and then Luffy walks away. This is the sad part. Luffy walks away, and then Zolo falls asleep, and Nojiko tells the story. And eight years ago. Nami was like, like that. It was like stealing books and stuff. And then we meet the mother, Bellamere, the foster mother. That's Bellamere. It's so sad what Bellamere did. Yes. She. I thought like she like looks like Sanji. She has a cigarette. Cigarette. Like Sanji also has cigarettes. So yeah. And she like bribes people. Like, I so. so Bellamere, Najiko, and Nami when they were like eight years ago when they were like poor people and everything. And they're like very poor. And Nami has a dream like to make, uh, to be a navigator, okay? And they all fight. Nami and Najiko fight over like clothes and stuff. And Nami says like, we're not even blood. And then Bellamere like slaps Nami for saying that. We're, I don't know we're not blood, but we're still with the same people. And Nami runs away to Genzo's house, and Genzo tells the truth. I was so, like, I almost cried that part. Like, this whole black flashback is the saddest i ever seen in the whole One Piece. Like, literally. But, so, Genzo tells the story that her, your mother is actually very good. What, no, so, the, it was a huge rain. Bellamere almost died, and she gave me, she gave the baby, she gave you to a guy, and hard. she was about to die, and then Najiko came carrying Nami, Najiko was like three years old, and 
so cute, so cute, oh, so cute. That's Nami, baby Nami, so cute, oh, so cute. I was like, oh, so sad, so sad. Keep on reading, and uh, they're like, Nojiko was like, come on, Nami, let's go. And then Arlong comes to the village and like, ha ha, it's my village now. And then chapter 78, Bitamir. Saddest part. So he tells people if you want to stay in that, I say like you have to pay a lot of money, like 25 million berries. And then, and then Bitamir. And so he asked money for like 100,000 for a per adult and 50,000 per child. And, 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 and so, Villamay doesn't have that kind of money, okay? She saved a little bit, but she doesn't have that kind of money. A hundred thousand, she has like a hundred thousand berries. She can save her health. And then, and then Arlong's like, hey, look at that house over there. And then like, everybody's scared they run and do something. And Arlong's like, I'll kill you if you don't give me the money. And she just gives the money. And she does, and they're like, everybody, and Genzo's like, don't tell about the two kids, uh, Bellamere. Don't tell about Nujiko and Nami, because if you don't have 200,000, you have 100,000. And then she gives 100,000 to Liv. And then she actually spills the tea, says, that's all I've got for my daughters. Like, Bellamere, I was like, what? Why did you say that? And Bellamere, like, uh, they're, as much as mine, those two are my children. Everybody's like so sad. And then Bellamy Bel and Nami and Nojiko like hug for the last time. Yeah, hug for the last time. And Arlong kills Bellamy uh, in front of Nojiko and Nami. Chapter 79 to live. Chapter 79 to live. Okay. Losing a mother was like, there was so much pain in my heart. Like, I almost cried. There was so much sadness. Like, she'd gone through so much stuff. And then after that, uh, Arlong like sees this navigator. She wants to be a navigator, and Arlong like ta Arlong like takes be takes uh, Nami and leaves. And then Na and Nami's like found on the street, and they're like, I just joined their crew and stuff, and they gave me money and everything. And they're like, never come to this village again. You just joined the worst people ever, and your mom was just killed. And Najiko, so Nami tells Najiko that. And in chapter 80, a uh, thief is a thief. Na and so, like, Nami, and then Nami was like, so Nujiko's like, Nami, she is actually trying to get 100 million berries so she can uh, save up, and she needs like 70, 7 million more, and she can buy the village and save everybody in, the, in Coco Village, and she can escape, you know? But Arlong's just sneaky, but a very evil one. Seven million berries to go, and then Luffy's like walking on the street, and then Genzo brings the the, the navy guys to Nami's house. Navy uh, Captain Nazumi of Navy Base Sixteen. He's like, "Give me all. You're a thief. You stole all our stuff, all the money and stuff." And they're like, "They they take the money from Nami's house." And then, and then Nami finds out, did Arlong send you base ca a Navy base camp guy to come here and take my money? Arlong is such a cheater, such a cheat. And they, and Nami's like, she runs for her and wants to kill like Arlong. And Arlong's like, it's just business. And he pushes away, and then chapter 81 tears. 
they take the, all the all the money away. And now he's like crying. He crying and she finds Luffy. And then uh, no no no, she tells everybody don't go and fight them. And Genzo's like no no. And then Nami and then Luffy finds Nami and says, Lu and then Nami says Luffy, you help Luffy. Help. And Mo and Luffy is like in Sinbad. Look at him. He's infuriated. Okay, and look what he does. He takes his straw hat, gives it to Nami, and he goes to fight. It's so sad. And oh Luffy. It's so sad. Look, I think Nami has a crush on Luffy. Yeah. Look at this. Like, so Luffy, don't touch the hat. It's my treasure. And, oh, Luffy, she gave, he gave his treasure to her. Like, I think she fell in love. She's in love with him. And then, all along, like, jump, and then Luffy jumps in and, like, but he smashes the whole place and, like, which one, he says, which one is Arlong? Who are you? And then, Okay, in fact, I think this must. Is this my best? It's my favorite. Is this book my favorite book in One Piece so far? Well, yes. It was just so emotional, so fighting. Like, it's going very well right now. They're fighting a lot. I like this a lot. Very good. There. Not, probably the night. This is my best book I read. Um, nine point nine. No, nine point nine. Yeah, nine point nine. This is a nine point nine book. My best book I ever read. It won't be so emotional or everything. I can't believe her mother died, and she's just doing everything for her village. But the best part is gonna be chapter nine ten because. Yo, Arlong versus Luffy, man? You don't know what's gonna happen. You don't know what's gonna happen, bro. But what I mean, wait, I need some more books. I only have like two books left to read. Read. <laughs> read. So, yeah. But that's it. Love this a lot. I love these books. Um, uh, I'll get some books soon, guys. Don't worry. I'm almost at 100 chapters. Almost. This is your life, yeah. I think. Do you guys think Luffy is gonna leave Orlong Village? Also, the chapter and the volume nine is the is tears. It's a hundred, two hundred pages, and I didn't even see the time go so good. I didn't even know the time went that fast. But that's it for this video, guys. I hope you guys liked it. See you guys tomorrow, probably tomorrow, probably. I have to read this and review it tomorrow. But yeah, bye.